feel like I'm too far back. What's up, everybody? There's already somebody watching this. That's insane. What's up, guys? It's been a little while. I think it's been about four weeks since I've done Foxy Friday. So, we are going to unbox exactly what you saw inside of the thumbnail. Once people get in here, once we get some comments. Yo, Funko and Figs, what's happening, my man? Uh, so, yeah, we got some stuff to unbox. And I guess we got a lot of catching up to do. What's up, Chris? How's it going? Because I haven't live streamed in a long time. So, there we go, guys. We're going to unbox these two. And I just got something in the mail today. Mysterio. So, uh, super, super exciting. How's everybody doing? Seven people in here so far. Not bad for a random Saturday night live stream. What's up, Joe? Funko and Figs? Yo, man. Uh, I've been waiting a long time for these things. I'm the best. No, man. You're the best. What's up, Nightwalker? Hmm. Yeah, guys. So, uh, what is everybody doing? Has anybody found anything today? I'm just, uh, I was just playing Fortnite with Josh, and, uh, that's about it, honestly. What's up, Knight of Ren? Yo, thank you, Chris, for liking. Hey, yo, Josh, what's happening, my man? I just saw you. Can't stay long going Josh's live stream when he starts. Actually, Space Face, this is the pre-show to Josh's live stream. So as soon as, at like, 8.55, I'm going to hop off here, and y'all can go straight over to Josh's live stream. <clears throat> Need to hook up on Fortnite. For sure, man, I am terrible, but we can work something out. What's up, Daniel? Did I get a win? I haven't got a win on Fortnite in a while. I'm terrible at that game. Yo, you just got the new Thor. I love it, bro. Thank you, Chris. I have been working on this collection for quite some time now. <clears throat> Yo, it's been so long since I live streamed. I feel like I feel like I've never done it before. So bear with me, honestly. <clears throat> yeah. So exactly uh, once around nine o'clock, I'm gonna hop off here, and Josh is going to do his live stream tonight uh it's gonna be a lit live stream make sure you are checking that out has anybody found a range trooper that was i found three of them for three cents i took advantage of that that's for sure yeah i'm not used to live streaming on saturday honestly i'm not what happened to good fig in the morning uh life bill i <laughs> really really busy week so a lot of stuff came up no good figging morning uh no good fig in the morning this week Josh, uh, I got your merch. You got my merch, Chris. That's dope, dude. Uh, I need to actually wear my own merch. First live stream married. That's true, Space Face. That's true. Yeah, so pretty much I'm doing this live stream to make up for the fact that there's no good fig in the morning, and I did not live stream last night. So, there we go. This is why I'm here right now. Where is your collection in the collection spot? I have not even went through all the pictures yet, Night of Rain. There's a lot of people that sent pictures, so I haven't even looked through... Um, any news toilated this week so bear with me uh davy's action figures what's up dude got ya will pm you my psn for sure man i saw your other stream the oh the the stream with the bird yeah still he's up for adoption if you guys want him um yeah we'll send him right to you i dm'd him to you a while ago yeah night it's only one per video so I'm only picking one per video. Look forward to seeing your guy, you guys and your vids. Yeah, well, me and Brooklyn may or may not go hunt tomorrow. So there may or may not be a new toy hunt up this week. We just had to find out. But while I'm yapping, I'm going to go ahead and pop one of these guys open. <clears throat> because Iron Patriot, it was a surprise live stream. <laughs> Fucking Iron Patriot. Yeah, which one should you guys want to see open first? Ant-Man or Thor? Let me know in the comments below. Give me some answers here. We also got Mysterio. I just haven't popped him open yet. So. Yeah, Josh says Deadpool. I'm going to open Deadpool. What kind of phone do I have? Um, is it S8 Plus? S8. I think it's just regular S8. Fucking, I thanks for the $2 Iron Patriot, even though you insulted me. <laughs> we got a Thor, and we got an Ant-Man. Will you do me a favor? Will you hand me the box cutter? It's right there. Thank you. You're not missing much. The only thing I saw was new was Jurassic Park Pops. Is that hunting-wise? Because, dude, um, a guy in my area named LeVon Crump, who's on the syndicate, actually found two Black Knights in Knoxville, Tennessee. So I'm going to check the area just in case. 
Plus, I like to hunt, and no matter what's out there, I just like to go out and film stuff. So, scored the Black Widow and Black Knight from the New Wave. Yo, I think the only ones I want after this, uh, Ant Man, and uh, actually, you know what? I'm not gonna say that. Um, I want every single one of these because I want to build coal, obsidian. Um, but the, the next one I'm looking for is Black uh, Black Knight for sure. Black Widow would be pretty dope to have too. And I feel like I'm going to have to have Wasp. I'm gonna. That's just how I am. Yeah, and I ran two Black Knights in Knoxville. He found one in a Walmart and one in a GameStop. So, yo, yeah, I've been hearing GameStop has them. Yeah, so check your GameStops for the new wave, the Cold Obsidian wave. I feel like I'm, like, super close. Huh? Why not? Okay. That's what I just feel like I am. I need a better chair. I need to, like, invest in a good chair once I get a place. Well, wow, I've, I've seen you before, sir. Yeah, so guys, what, uh, I saw Josh kind of pose the question, um, what did you guys, did you guys go hunt today? I'm rusty at this whole live stream gig, but I'm going to get back to it. Yo, yo, what's up, Dominic? Uh, where did I buy this stuff? I got Ant-Man and Thor from KB Toys, not the KB Toys, but it's a KB Toys in St. Augustine, Florida. He was a little local comic book shop down there uh, more of a toy shop though because there's not very many comics there are some just not a lot and uh, dude is awesome though he actually comes up to Gatlinburg to to have vacation all the time oh okay you were talking about the good figure morning show I haven't seen anything new coming out besides that pop yeah there's been a few things announced I've kind of I've looked on there a little bit not too much but uh I try not to. I'm trying not to keep Good Fig and Morning straight news. I'm trying to throw some stuff in there as well. Uh, Good Fig and Morning is going to be ever evolving in its course of its lifespan. So be on the be open minded when it comes to Good Fig and Morning because it's going to be fig related. Might be pops. Might be Mezco. Might be WWE. Might be Marvel. You just never know. Um, but it's going to be ever changing because the game, the the toy collecting game, is ever changing. So want to kind of keep up with that but there is Paul Rudd if it would not focus on my ugly mug there we go there's the Paul Rudd head sculpt I've showed this on a lot of my recent videos I believe so there's Paul Rudd right there um WWE sucks lately yo I agree with that and what's up Keyshawn how you doing you saw Ant-Man and Thor at GameStop in Hickory North Carolina yesterday yeah they're showing up they are showing up everywhere I like the Paul Rudd Paul Rudd, Paul Rudd head sculpt. It's just I really, I just like Ant Man in general. So that looks good. I I like this head sculpt a lot. So can I play Dead Trigger? I don't even know what that is. Explain. Yeah, Bill. I really wanted the older Ant Man, but I never, I never got into it. I never. I don't think I was collecting Legends at the time. To be honest with you, with the with the older Ant Man, and uh, I only saw it at a con one time, and I didn't pick it up. I'm glad I didn't though, because this dude that he fills that void on my shelf, I guess you could say. In other news, I'm spending a crap ton of money on old Star Wars figures. Josh, bro, we gotta talk, man. It's the first the first step mm -hmm. is acceptance, Josh. So you have a problem. <laughs> Those gains. Yeah, I wish I was having gains, bro. I only weigh like 190. I'm not gonna say. Josh, I might be late tonight. Yo, Kyle, because you're watching my stream? Is that why? It's like a zombie game where you had to do missions and stuff. No, but I can go check that out. That sounds fun. Yo, Iron Patriot, what are you, what are you foxing me for? So, <laughs> whoa, space space. What are you doing, bro? What are you doing? Is that real? Is this showing up? Space space. What's what's going on, dude? 14. Thank you. I mean, obviously, but yo, I ain't got no whiskey. <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw that in Josh's live stream, though. But uh, somebody actually donated Josh $30 for a shot of whiskey. And I'm, I'm not taking those shots tonight, bro, because the only thing I got is in that closet up there some warm-ass Hennessy, and I am not doing that. Hennessy warm? No. No, no, no. And that's still the, That's still the same bottle from the bachelor party, bro. Yo, speaking of Bachelor Party, I still have to edit the Bachelor Party and Wedding Vlog. 
have not done that. Chris Lemus, 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 I do not, I do have a PS3. It's in, no wait, it's in the closet. Um, I have a PS4 somewhere around here. I think it's on the top now. Not, no, it's right here. Keep it forever. Yo, it's like that muffin that's still in my car. That you were taking next time you were down here, or I'm up there. Oh, okay, anyway, so here is Ant-Man. Uh, I think I've showed you guys this about three times now without actually showing the figure. But he's really, really cool. The only problem that I had with him is that one foot posing, like where he, if he's running or something, his upper torso is really, really top-heavy. So, like, the only problem I've had is actually keeping him, like, in a running pose. I mean, you can always drop down the back leg to where it's, like, he's just now taking off, kind of like that. But I like Ant-Man in, like, a whole little running pose. I just think it looks good, even though he don't have, like, super speed or anything like that. But, uh, if you work with it, you can eventually get it, so. Hey, Foxy, it's Tony. What's up, Tony? I have a PS3, PS3 to what kind of games do you have? Yo, honestly, I'll be quite honest. Um, I have not played an actual like story-based video game since me and Josh started playing Fortnite. I really want to play God of War, like really, really bad want to get God of War, but I just haven't, honestly. I'm loving that Ant-Man, bro. Great grab. Thank you, Nightwalker. How was my wedding? Uh, Brooklyn, how was the wedding? It was good. It was good. My dog tried to jump through a window to get to the Amazon, dude. Yo, that's a good dog, bro. My dog's even bark when FedEx pulled up with Mysterio. Oh, the dude didn't even ring the doorbell or a or answer or answer or knock. What am I saying? I think I'm still buzzed from last night. I'm like getting flashbacks from it. This giant. Man. Are you guys following me on Instagram? If you guys did, do you know that what happened last night? I uh, we went to a karaoke bar and that was hilarious. I'm surprised you didn't puke. No, man, not this time. Nope. Thanks for wishing that upon me, though. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and pop open Thor. Now, I will say this Thor right here is probably my favorite figure so far, uh, especially, I think, Legends-wise. It's probably my favorite Legend this year. So this Thor is awesome. If you look closely to my picture, it's my dog. Y'all, I'm not going to lie. I thought that was Groot in that picture the entire time. You've seen the thumbnail. Yo, dude, thank you. Big ass YouTube star gets drunk and yells, I'm a YouTuber. I actually never did. Honestly, yeah, it's surprising. I guess if you're a YouTuber, you're like, you're allowed to do those things. But let's see. What's up, East Tennessee? What's up, Memphis Dale? Yo, okay, guys. I'm seeing 30 people in here and 14 likes. Let's get that ratio closer. And I don't mean leave, I mean get that like up. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take out the store. RIP if you're wearing headphones. All right, and in the box, of course, you get the build a build a figure piece for Cole. I need Thor and Malekith to complete the wave. Yo, I need a lot to complete the wave. This is the only two that I have so far, but this store is dope. I dare you to do ten push-ups. Yo, no. Um, Miss these streams, dude. Yeah, guys, I miss streaming, honestly. Um, me and Josh were just playing uh, playing Fortnite, obviously, and we we were just talking about how much we we used to both and like stream all the time. And Josh still does. Josh still streams a lot, um, yeah, a lot more than I do. That's just with my work. I have like every other Friday that I'm not closing. Like next Friday, I think I close, so I will definitely won't be doing Foxy Friday next Friday either. Um, unless I get it worked, which I probably could, honestly, um, just to have that day off, to be honest, because I, I hate working Friday nights. It's awful. Because usually if I work a Friday night, I have to be back in the morning at like 8 a.m. So I close at 1030 and be back at 8 a.m. So it's great. Hope that wave hits New York soon so I can hit the apocalypse wave soon. Yo, that's coming out very soon. I'm excited for that, too. That Wolverine and Magneto looks good. So, bro, sorry my phone died, but I'm loving the new Thor fig. Yo, I'm about to show that, actually. So, here he is, man. You want a weird pose he's in, too. So, yeah. There is Thor. Now, the head sculpt, it depends on, like, what angle you get it on, to be honest with you, if it looks good. Like, that right there it looks fantastic, but it comes sometimes, like, straight on. It's iffy. Yeah. 
Yeah, yeah, we we close at ten thirty, and most of the time when I'm at, whenever I work on Saturdays, I have to work at like eight or nine. So, yeah, they, apparently as long as you're off for eight hours, you can come back in. So yeah, if you guys have not gotten your hands on this <laughs> on this Thor, make sure you guys do. So this thing is, come on, come on. What are you doing? There we go. So it looks really, really good, of course. Back to my face. But yeah, this Thor looks really, really good, guys. Um, I think this is probably my favorite Thor that's come out. I have the older Thor with like the helmet and stuff on. And I have another one. I forgot which one it is. But um, he's, he's in a box somewhere. <clears throat> but uh, yeah, he is. This one's my, probably my favorite. It looks really, really good. Uh, it's MCU Thor, which I love MCU Thor. Will I buy any SHV Arts Infinity Wars? I think I'm going to get... Um, Ross from Friends, aka Captain America, and then I think I may or may not get the fail of the week from Good Fig in the Morning, Bucky, because I'm hoping that maybe they take feedback from the fans and they actually change that head sculpt. It looks awful right now, but if it gets changed, then I might have to pick it up. Yeah, Thanos as well. Thanos does look good. I think, I don't know, I, will he scale with Legends though? That's what I'm worried about, because SHV Arts is usually a little bit smaller. Thor was the MVP of Infinity War, that is for sure. So yeah, so there is Thor, and I'll put him right here beside of Ant-Man. And then I got this today. Yo, SH equals yuck, what are you talking about, bro? Come on now, Josh. Why don't you be playing with people's hearts like that? You buy your first hot toy Thanos. <clears throat> Yo, the Hot Toy Captain America looks really, really good. Um, I would love to have that, honestly. Because I know with their pre-orders, you can pre-order it right now, and you don't get you don't get charged until like four months until it release. And I think um, the release date is around June of next year or January of next year, one of the J's. Um, so it's, it's tempting, especially for like $50 a month. That's not bad. Honestly, I'm not into SHV rights that much. I, just, I love my turtles. Yo, I just love my NECA turtles. These things are dope. I'm going to get the rest of the boys pretty soon, but they're dope. All right, guys. I love the DBZ, DBZ ones. Yo, I have the <clears throat> Deadshot. Of course, Josh got that for me in the friend box. Uh, speaking of friend box, I got shot for that. I got some things for it already, but... I'm, I'm making this one a good one. It might be a little bit longer than this month before you get it, Josh, but uh, soon. <clears throat> Let's see. Now you tripping. So what has everybody, what's everybody looking for? Let me know in the comments below. What's the one figure in your collection, or not in your collection, that's not in your collection that you're looking for right now? It could be past, present, coming out soon. Uh, tell me in the comments below. What are you looking for? 28 people. I want to know. Want twenty eight comments? Star Wars Vintage Collection Republic Gunship Kaioken El Hunter is looking for the cable. Ryan A is looking for cable as well. All right, I'm not gonna put his effects anywhere near him because that's just gonna be time consuming. So. I will show you guys those on Instagram. Make sure you're following me on Instagram. It's at Foxy for Real, just like right there. Uh, let's see, 3.75 inch clones. Yo, I see a lot of people getting in, getting into and or collecting those clones right now. They are nice. If I was a 3.75, well, I guess I am. I do like the 3.75 inch. Um, and if I had more space, I think I would probably collect a lot more. Uh, but those things are pretty damn sweet. I am ready for those new Dragon Ball Z super figs, bro. I am. Need the Toy Biz Giant Man build a figure. Yo, is that the one that Essos, Sal? Did he get that one in uh, Kokomo? Is that where he got Kokomo? Yo, this guy is sweet. I'm not gonna lie. I couldn't. I don't like how loose this is, but it's okay. But he is, uh... he's dope. I love this. I just love this color scheme the purple and green. 
That's nice. And you guys know I've been looking for this forever. I've been trying to borrow it from somebody for a while now. <laughs> he should have came with a stand. Yeah, I agree. He is kind of weird, honestly. But he's cool. He's cool for sure. There we go. So I did get the white head sculpt. Which one is everybody looking for? There's a green and a white, right? I just I haven't really paid too much attention to the the hype surrounding the different colors. So there he is without without his helmet or whatever you call this. There that is. I was about two hours late on a material today here in Sydney, Nova Scotia. Man, that's awful. He should have came with a stand. It's okay. Trying to get Marvel Legends Spider-Man Noir. Hopefully I'll get one in Target or Walgreens. Yo, I got mine at GameStop, actually. Oh, a GameStop close to me has a last year that I'm going to pick up within the next few weeks if it's still there. Because I kind of want to get... I want to build Lizard Wave because I just think he's a cool villain for uh, Spider-Man. Here's the deal, though. I don't particularly want Spider-Woman. And I'm not too hot on Prowler, to be honest with you. So, like, last year's the last one I want. So, if anybody's, like, selling and or trading their parts from either one of those, Prowler or Spider-Woman, PM me on Instagram. Like, I know I said I was going to get this entire wave when it came out, whenever it was coming out. But I think I changed my mind on those, too. Let's just plug that cape back in there. There we go. That'll say a little bit. What were people saying? Foxy, let me know when you're down in Nashville, my boy, so we can hunt down here. For sure, dude. That sounds good. Apparently, the green head is a more rare one to find. Okay. That makes sense. Uh, the, the, they had two shipments out at Walmart so far. I bought a Smart Man Noir. So is Spider Woman. Wait. So is Spider Man Woman what? Sweet. Oh. Where did you say that? It said last year it's seventeen ninety nine. Okay, well then I'll get it from Amazon. Set up paying the twenty two ninety nine that game is on game is on GameStop once. Whew, it's like last night all over again. I can't talk. I want to create a Spider Verse shelf. Spider Ham maybe coming later this year. Yeah, dude, I heard he is coming later this year. I will have a Gwenpool and Spider Man Noir piece. Do you need Bud? Do I need Bud? Yo, soccer boy, what's up, man? I'll have a Gwenpool. Oh, peace. Peace. Okay. I didn't understand that. Uh, no, I think the only pieces that I need is um, <laughs> um, Spider Woman and the other one that I said Prowler. Do you need to build a figure piece? No, nah, dude, I just, uh, just Prowler and Spider Woman. Uh, we have, if anybody has those, just let me know. Because I think uh, not we man. <laughs> Yo, I really wasn't a understanding what you were. <laughs> yeah, I have Spider-Punk. I have all of them, but... Let me see. I have all of them, but Lasher, Prowler, and... Noir or no, I have Noir. Spider-Woman. So, I have not saw Deadpool 2. I have not. We are going to go see it, possibly, uh, next day off. Which will probably be Thursday. Have you saw, I mean, without being, without any spoilers, is it, if anybody has saw Deadpool, no spoilers, like I said, um, how is it? Is it worth it? Is it good? I mean, I'm sure it is. I had a few boobly bops here. <laughs> That's good. I like the way you put that. So yeah, I'm really, really excited about this Mysterio. He looks really, really good. Be cool. I know somebody put a, like an LED inside of his helmet. That'd be cool to do because that would look really, really good. But I'm still stuck on this Thor. This Thor just looks too good. I mean, with those two next to each other, ah, we gotta get Mysterio on the big screen. We gotta do it. And then you got Ant Man. These just look awesome. Best end credit scene ever. All right, that make that gives me faith. Faith. I'll see you guys later. Gotta get going. Jo Sorry, Josh can't mod tonight. Foxy's got this. I got this for a little while. I got Mesco 112, Judge Dread and Bike, and it's awesome. I was impressed. Yo, Mesco is fantastic. If I had the money to buy one every day, every week, I would. Um, seriously, they are fantastic figures. Bye, P. Have a good night, bro. You're just abandoning the most lit live stream ever. It's not that lit, let's be honest.
I'm gonna get drunk for that. So yeah, for real, um, here in a few minutes I will be getting off of here so that Josh can take over for his Saturday Night Live stream. I don't want to intrude on that because technically this is the pre-show to his show because I didn't get to do it last night and there's no good big morning this weekend. So this is probably this is just me hanging out with you guys and saying sorry that there's no <sighs> other videos this weekend. But I'm going on a hunt tomorrow and uh, I think we're going to, I have a good, I have a good faith in this hunt. So, oh, that Thor man, wow, the mezco are awesome. Too pricey for my cheap ass. I collect too many lines. Amen to that. I know, right? Glad with my new Thor, man. I only had enough for one Thor or Ant-Man and went with Thor. Good choice, dude. Ant-Man's dope, but something about that Thor is just awesome. I've been seeing a lot of people leaving him on the pegs, too. Like, I don't know what's up with that, but I wouldn't. I couldn't do it. Um, could not do it. I bought... I mean, the guy that I bought him from had him for 23 which is over retail. But he didn't charge tax. So when you take that into consideration... And you're thinking, okay, a smaller business is getting my business other than a big corporation. Uh, there was, it was a no-brainer. Foxy for real from the depths of Tennessee. What's what's good, my guy? Yo, man, just uh, just chilling, dude. Actually, happy I get to live stream with you guys. It's uh, it's been a little while. And uh, next, whenever I get a Friday free, we are going to do this again, or hopefully maybe just a day free. It's like 30 minutes, a random day of the week. It's going to happen. And when we can do Foxy Friday, it'll be a celebration. I hope. I mean, you got them early. I would be hype as hell. Yo, dude. For real. Exactly, Bill. That's what you'd pay at, at GameStop. Then you had to try to get tax. And then uh, you trade in your games for like $20 store credit or $2 in cash. So do I have the Build-A-Figure Ant-Man? No, I do not. I honestly don't focus too much on Build-A-Figures unless I really, really like them. Um... If y'all have stuck with me for a while, a lot of you know that I don't really focus too much on the build of figures. But Lizard is calling my name, and so is Cole Obsidian. Because Cole is pretty damn cool. Am I collecting DC Batman the Animated Series? No, they are great, though. Josh and I look at a lot of them in Lexington. And uh, they're pretty sweet. Let's see. I wish the build of figure Ant-Man was bigger. Yeah. I mean, considering it's pretty much... Giant man, I guess. I guess that'd be... But, I mean, it's pretty good size. Your bids are awesome, man. Congrats on the wedding. Got to finish some NHL. Good night. Thank you so much, dude. I appreciate that. Um, you have a good night. Hope your favorite team wins. Wish the build... Okay, so weird. I mean, it's a slow night tonight, guys. What's up? I need to... I want some questions and some answers and some... What did you pick up over the weekend? Um, what are you looking forward to most coming out this year? Just... Uh, Tell me in the comments below. What is your favorite movie that came out this year so far? And are you hyped for Solo? Even though some people say it sucks. Is it true Coles is getting figures? I'll let you know when I see them in my store. Honestly, I'm not quite sure. Um, I think so. We used to have Black Series a while back. And uh, um, by the way, I, I have been seeing people comment on this on the Syndicate and on Open Box Mafia and stuff like that. Coles is expensive on their toys. If you shop on the wrong days, shop on Thursday through Sunday. That's mostly when the sales happen, and there's always a coupon online. So, guarantee I can get, you can get a Black Series figure for under twenty dollars at Colts if you do it right. Silver Foe Saturday with Foxy. Hey, that's what we're gonna call it, bro. That might be it. Silver Fox Saturday. Okay. Well, that's all right. I like that too. Will you collect Hot Toys in the future? Yes. Mine was eliminated. Oh, man. I'm sorry about that. Well, hopefully your runner-up wins then. But yeah, if you guys shop Thursday through Saturday or Thursday through Sunday with a coupon, I guarantee you'll get a good deal on some figs at Kohl's. And a lot of times they're buy one, get one half. So even if they are $30 or the first one and you get one half, you're still paying less if you want to. So... The X-Men wave is my most anticipated wave. The Walgreens thing is most an anticipated single fig. Yo, the thing does look pretty dope. I don't, I haven't got the X, the Fantastic Four yet, but the thing might happen. I'm hyped for the thing and Silver Surfer. Yeah, Silver Surfer looks great. I, I really do want that one. That'll be one, that'll be the figure that gets me back into Walgreens hunting. I know, like, way back on my videos, that's what I used to do. It was, like, a loop. 
in Walgreens, like in my area. And I found some good stuff. I mean, I did. I saw someone posted saying Hasbro Rimp Rep mentioned that. Yeah, I've been hearing the same thing. But you never know. Cole, and it, it has to do with, what, with the store size as well. Uh, there's three different classifications of stores, and it has to do with the store size. So your store might be a small store, and it won't get any, while a store a few miles away will be a large store, and it will get in. Will, they will get some. Marvel Legends design getting as good as NECA. No kidding, bro. Like, that's hard to compete with. NECA's fantastic. And then you look at some of these Hasbro figs lately, and it's just, it's insane. What was that last comment? Am I into horror figs? Uh, if you count Predator as horror, uh, yes. If you count Jason, yeah. So, yeah, I'm into horror figs. What you looking at? Are you watching the stream? I think it's you. So, I saw your vid when you came to Nashville, and that Target you went to, trust me, bro, there was never anything there. Are you talking about the one that's, like, right outside of Nashville? That, uh, this dude that I was talking to on, on, uh, Facebook, he was looking for a fig. I think it was a Star-Lord at that time, because they had just came out. So, I put it in the, uh, the cabinet, like, the furniture section for him, and he came back, he came, like, an hour after we were there, and he picked it up. So, it was kind of funny. Um, I forgot what his, I forgot what his name was. I mean, I might be mistaken somebody. That was the best place around Nashville. Yeah, that was... Oh, the one next to GameStop. Hopefully. I'm not sure. If we stopped at that one in um, Gallatin. Yeah. Yeah, that's what he said, Gallatin Pike. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know, man. At the time, that was probably one of the best areas we stopped at while we were in Nashville, to be honest. Um... And did I pre-order the Black Series Admiral Piet? Uh, I did not. I, I don't know. It's just, I like, it's a toss, that's a toss-up thing for me, I guess. He's a cool character, but he's a very minuscule character, unless you, like, read the Legends or whatever it's called. Um, but, I mean, maybe. I might do that. It, it just, it just depends. How are the foxes liking the married life? It's pretty good. Yeah, it's not bad. Uh, not a lot has changed. Um, really, I mean, we just, yeah, I mean, I'm sure later down the road, maybe like when we get our own house and stuff, but I mean, I got this like really fancy ring, so that's cool. If you guys saw that yet or not, but, uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Thanks for asking. Must've been my luck, dude. I'm sorry about that. It was also like, what, a year and a half ago? Things change, dude. We all know that like toy, the toy hunting game changes every week. So like, something that you see this week might be worth a lot of money next week for some odd reason. Especially with pop figures. Pop figures are the worst for that. I just like Empire Figs the best in the Black Series. Yo, me too, bro. The Sith, the Sith, Sith side, or the dark side, whatever you want to call it, is probably my favorite. And of course, I just got into the, good, the, the light and the good side. So, yeah. I love the Black Series, though. Probably one of my favorite things to collect, to be honest with you. What was the last comment? Retro Force says, thumbs up. Appreciate that, dude. Yeah, man, I'm so, I'm sober on Pops right now. I'm into Legends a lot. The last Pop that I bought was Juggernaut, and that was on vacation. So, uh, no offense, glad I'm not into Pop Figs. Yo, no offense taken whatsoever. I have actually slowed down a ton um, on Pop Figures. They're, the ones that I have in my collections right now are the ones that I just, I love. Like, I, they, they're a character that I actually care for. Um, and, uh, you know, it's just, I weeded out the, collect in my collection, I weeded out the pop figures that I just did not have any idea, like, why I had in my collection. Had nothing else to go along with it. I kind of got rid of all of those. And now, like, Mortal Kombat, uh, gaming figs like that, um, Star Wars, my DBZ collection, my Winter Soldier, stuff like that. My Chases, of course. Um, I, I kept all those because I love those. But I got rid of everything else that I just I just didn't need. You know, it was just taking up space. I uh, didn't need it at all. It was not fitting in my collection. So I just kind of, I think I sold 48 pops at one time on eBay. So, yeah, I just, you heard about Mortal Kombat 11 being made? No, but I'll have to beat Brooklyn's ass on that one, too. I don't think she caught that. Agreed and good to know. No offense. That's like mine and Brooklyn's game, like for real. We will go back and forth on Mortal Kombat 
like all night like for real it's just it's so freaking competitive between me and her and of course Kenshi is my boy and so is uh Cyrax only pops I'm collecting is DBZ pops just got Zeno yo we saw Zeno at um Chicago in Chicago that was awesome because it was like it wasn't even on the market yet they couldn't sell it they was just like there for display Yo, I love Cyrax too, bro. Cyrax is one of my favorite characters in Mortal Kombat. Uh, Scorpion is one of my favorite. And, uh, of course, Kenji. I love Kenji. What's up, Clay? How are you doing? Hope you're having a great night. Actually, it's 8.50. I got, like, what, five, six more minutes to run. So if you guys want to, like, talk about anything whatsoever, this is just a random live stream, guys. Prepping you for Josh's live stream. Um, if you guys aren't following Josh, which I'm not sure why you are. Like, if you're following me, I'm pretty sure you're following Josh. Um, but if you're not, Josh Pence, Josh, comment right now so people know you're live streaming right after this. So it's like back to back. We are taking over YouTube. We we're going to have our own TV station one time, one day. Uh, you thinking about going to Star Wars Celebration? Uh, yes, we are actually. Um, if Brooklyn should have vacation time, and if she doesn't, she can definitely get a few days off. So we're probably going to hit hit that up. If you come to Comic Con in Nashville, hit me up. We friends on Facebook, right? Yeah, for real, dude. A bottle opener, bro. Just uh, take take my advice. Go to your porch and just like put it on the lip of your your railing, and just hit it down. It comes right off. You try to click classic figs, Joe's. I just saw Josh my Target Clone Wars. Nice. I honestly don't have any retro uh, retro figs, vintage figs, anything like that. I do, however. Um, oh, that's true. You, you, why are you streaming? Just open a bunch of them, put them in your fridge, and then just drink them throughout the night um, before you start. But I do like the uh, vintage collection from Star Wars. I do have a few of those. I'm starting to get into those, 3.75 inches and stuff like that. Um, really, really enjoying those. So that, that's something that I'm starting to get into as well. Uh, let's see. Foxy, keep up the work, man. I'm enjoying your content. Thank you, Retro. I really do appreciate that. I work super hard on my edits. So Brooklyn knows this firsthand. Josh knows this firsthand. He's edited with me. Like I will just like sit there and for like three hours on one single like clip of some sort space face i do believe brennan that's your name right yep that's it um you will be seeing a lot of other people other than us on there for sure no i do not collect naruto my boy jesus does though if you want to follow somebody that does that i can't believe i still got my hasbro atat at that damn flies time flies quick as hell it sure does wish i was collecting back in 20 2008 too you can use butter knife or keys, man. Yeah, dude. We us alcoholics got you. So we we will get your beer open for you, Josh. We do not care how we do it. Josh, are you going live at exactly nine? Because if you are, I'll go to like eight fifty eight and I'll just cut it. Also, you seen the new Dragon Ball Z super poster? I have not. Will you send that to me? Cause I'm I'm all about some new DBZ. So yeah, guys, uh, it's been fun tonight. I will see you guys on a little bit of Josh's live stream. Me and Brooklyn are gonna watch a movie here in a few minutes in a little while. So once it comes on, um, so I'll see you guys in Josh's live stream as well. You can talk to me there, follow me there if you want to. Um, I'm think I think even though I love. Foxy Friday. I love the name of Foxy Friday and it's hard to get away from Foxy Friday. I may have to change my live stream day to another time just because like or another day just because Friday is such a busy day for me. If we're if I'm not working, um, I'm doing something. So yeah, we'll probably have to change Foxy Friday. We'll do Foxy Friday whenever I'm off and I'm free, but we might have to think of something else and that'll be in the works pretty soon. So let's see. It's only 5.53 here. You got plenty of time. Yeah. I've got like I got like four minutes to go, so uh, I'm not gonna hop off here just yet. But yeah, Fridays are super busy, so we'll think of something. I don't know. I might need y'all support and help with that. Think of some kind of name for some kind of live stream. You know, I don't even have to have a name to be honest with you. A lot of people think they have to have a name for their live streams, but you really don't. It's just Foxy Friday was a good little jingle, and uh, it kind of went. So kind of like Good Fig and Morning. 
Speaking of good figure morning, I might make t-shirts with that logo. I might do it. I haven't actually played with t-shirt designs in a long time. Later, bro. Great show. Thank you, A. Lopez. Yo, hopefully I see you on Josh's. All right, so three minutes countdown. Anybody got anything to say whatsoever? Just say what's up. Uh, tell me what you guys are hunting for. See you, Andrew. Have a good night. Swipe out of that. Josh said, bro. What's up, bro? What's up, Jesse? Yo, guys. Everybody do me a favor right now. I have 34 people watching. So Jesse is in here. Jesse is actually now my sister-in-law. It's Brooklyn's sister. She's wanting to get her own YouTube channel started. I don't know if you guys will be into the stuff that she does, but just to give her a little boost, just to help her out, guys, click on Jessie Jo right there and subscribe to her. She's awesome. She's hilarious. Um, do me a favor. Say what's up, Jessie, um, and then just, just subscribe. Just do that for me. One thing for me. One little thing. Subscribe to her. Huh? I just cracked myself up on how I'm opening these beers. They got the new... How are you doing? I don't... I want to know. What's up, Jesse? Big fan here. <laughs> they got the new SS... Supreme 4 Goku. What? For real? I will check that out then. You and I and Josh will talk. I'll talk soon. Sounds good, my man. Thank you. Yo, you're welcome. Everybody, do it. Go subscribe to her. We've got two minutes left until Josh's live stream. And uh, once again, guys, just a little recap. Thor? I got Thor. We got Ant-Man, two dope, awesome looking figs. Finally, I did, you know, I literally saved these in the box so that I could wait for a live stream just to be able to open these. I did that for you all, so remember that. And then, of course, we got Mysterio. So, yeah, I just got him today, and I got Thor and Ant-Man, like, three weeks ago. So, yo, I appreciate all of you guys subbing to her. That probably made her night, maybe even her week. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you in Josh's live stream. Uh, this was a little bit shorter of a live stream than I like, but I'm glad I could do one. I'm glad I wasn't too busy, and uh, I'm awesome. Thank you, Isaiah. Thank you. Um, yeah, so, guys, live streams very soon. I'm going to try to find out a new day. Um, we're going to do Foxy Fridays, of course, when I can, and uh, I'm a long-time subscriber of your channel. That's awesome, dude. Look at that, Jesse. You have fans. That's dope. So I'll see you guys on Josh's live stream. He'll be going live here in a few minutes. Show him some support. Hop on over there and say what's up. I'll be there for a little while, and I'll see you all then. Thank you all so much for watching. Remember to collect everything that you get. Click whatever you like. Don't let anybody stop you from doing that. Thank you all so much. I love you guys. And as always, stay foxy.